Thank you for tuning in to Inside Taiwan. I'm Melvin Tan. Taipei City Mayor Ke Wenzhe previously said that he would not participate in the National Day celebrations at the presidential office this year. Instead, Ke hosted a flag raising ceremony at Taipei City Hall Plaza. He invited the representatives from different ethnic communities to take part, saying he hopes that Taipei would become more diverse and harmonious. Tainan City Mayor William Lai also hosted a flag raising ceremony and stressed that Taiwan is an independent, sovereign state, and the future of Taiwan should be decided by all its inhabitants. Although there was no official call to attend, still hundreds of people came to the Tainan City government to attend the flag raising ceremony. Mayor William Lai personally presided over the flag raising. After the ceremony, people rushed to take a photo with him. Lai said he believed that the ceremony proved the existence of the Republic of China. It reiterated Taiwan's sovereignty and independence, and he also recognized the country's name as the Republic of China. Taipei City Mayor Ke Wenzhe previously said he would not participate in the National Day celebrations at the presidential office. However, he invited people from Taiwan's indigenous, Hakka, Hoklo, and new resident communities to come and raise the flag together. Ke said he hoped that Taipei residents would be happy. He did not want a serious activity and hoped that people would value diversity in the pursuit of harmony in Taipei. Kerr did not want the ceremony to be too serious, and the city government gave special gift bags and towels rolled up to look like birthday cakes for the Republic of China's birthday. Unfortunately, there were not enough to go around, and there was a mad rush to grab them, which caused some pushing and shoving. <laughs> 